and oh my god, it's getting darker and creepy as I walk deeper into the tunnel. I can't even see where I am walking. Oh my god. Hi guys, this is Kelvin and you're watching Juan Traveler. After closing for enhancement work since 2019, the central stretch of the rail corridors officially reopens on 22nd of March 2021 to the public with restored landmark bridges, new entry points, as well as better pedestrian walkway and underpasses. But did you know that beyond the newly opened rail corridor, there are many other places in Singapore to find abandoned and interesting sites that are linked to the old railway. In this series of day trip in Singapore, I will be exploring remaining traces of the old Jurong Railway along Clementi Road. So let's go! My first stop is at the overly famous railway bridge near the King Albert Park MRT station. You can click on the link above to watch my review on the rail corridor before and after the enhancement works. The highlight of today's series is to explore the abandoned railway tunnel. It is located just behind the bus stop opposite of Maju Camp. To be honest, I have taken bus from this very bus stop multiple times in the past to take IPPT in Maju Camp, but I have never noticed the tunnel until now. Wow, this is super cool! As how often do you get to stand on the train tracks in front of a tunnel? I mean, I feel like at any moment, a train will start rushing towards me from the tunnel itself. For your info, if you head towards this direction away from the tunnel, you can actually track through the Clementi Forest to get to the old Bukit Timah Railway Station. I might try that next time, but for now, it's time to explore more of the tunnel. The tunnel is actually longer than I expected. It's very cooling inside the tunnel, and the sound of traffic and insect from outside is getting softer while being overpowered by my own breathing and footsteps sound. And oh my god, it's getting darker and creepy as I walk deeper into the tunnel. I can't even see where I am walking. Oh my god. Suddenly, I just regret coming alone. It 
it feels like the tunnel is a dimensional gate or something and I will be teleported somewhere else when I reach the other end. Finally, I reached the other end of the tunnel. The tunnel really looks different from this end. It really does feel like I am not in Singapore anymore. If I cannot hear the sound of construction from nearby, I would really think that I have traveled to another dimension. Looking at the derailed tracks and fallen trees, I really feel that a dinosaur might charge right at me from the forest at any moment. So I do not know to feel happy or surprised when this guy suddenly ran past me. After leaving the tunnel, I headed to the last site of the day. Right here in the middle of the Karmati estate, you can actually see a railway bridge spanning across Sungai Ulu Pandan.
you have come to the end of the video. If you like my video, please hit the like button, share button, and subscribe button. Thanks for watching. Bye.